and one of Chicago's trendiest neighborhoods is now looking to hire its own security force. WGN's Julian Cruz is in the city's Fulton Market District with more. Hey guys, a new association of high-powered developers and restaurant groups backing this controversial proposal that reportedly calls for Fulton Market building owners, restaurants, and merchants to foot the bill for private 24-hour security patrols. Businesses are extremely upset that their property taxes have gone through the roof and that Alderman Burnett or any other city official now wants them to pay more money for police security they'd have already paid for. Roger Romanelli reaching out publicly to City Hall asking Mayor Brandon Johnson and 27th Ward Alderman Walter Burnett to stop the proposed Fulton Market private security plan. Everybody in the neighborhood's got to pony up a million dollars. Alderman Burnett, this makes no sense. Romanelli, longtime executive director of the Fulton Market Association, says smaller family-owned restaurants are being forced out of Chicago. But backers of the new security plan in published reports touting the benefits, financial and otherwise, of heightened security in the neighborhood, the newly formed Fulton Market Security Group proposing 24-hour private security patrols. According to reports, up to four patrol cars in the neighborhood bounded by Washington Boulevard, Hubbard Avenue, North Ogden Avenue, and North Halstead Street. But Fulton Market Association leaders say the city should instead tap into tax increment financing funds, or TIF funds for short, using this pool of taxpayer money, they argue, to finance the purchase of security surveillance cameras and more Chicago police patrols. If you look at London, you look at Vegas, L.A., other cities, they are using technology, modern cameras to apprehend criminals that would cost a fraction of what they're talking about with private security. We reached out repeatedly to the mayor's office for common as well as Alderman Walter Burnett in the 27th Ward, and we are also awaiting comment from the Fulton Market District Improvement Association. In the Fulton Market neighborhood, Julian Cruz, WGN News. All right, Julian, thank you. Well, the whereabouts of a French bulldog stolen from its owner are still not known. The owner said she was approached by a man with a gun demanding she turn over the dog named Peppa, which she adopted two months ago. This happened in the Portage Park neighborhood around Giddings and Menard Avenue on Wednesday. She resisted. He struck her in the right arm and the head, causing a concussion.